Look, look here, folks. I have come to a final conclusion and read every book I could possibly read. The Bible, research of spaceships flying through the air, and a lot of things. And I made my final decision about all the spaceships and stuff you see flying up in the air that Jesus Christ is the one that's flying these spaceships, bro. That's my final conclusion. Because if you think about it, a guy named uh, Commander Fravel came out with a video. You can look it up on YouTube, and this is known facts. Stating that he seen a spaceship that's shaped like a cross. And I read the Bible on and through and on throughout the whole Bible. And I came with my decision that Jesus Christ is the one that's operating these spaceships. And the elites know it. They know it because they don't want to let you know that Jesus Christ has been watching us the whole time. <laughs> Flying these spaceships. Uh, they say spaceships, but in the Bible it states chariots. And Jesus Christ has been operating these chariots the whole time. You know, going at speeds that out of this world. Zoom, zoom, zoom. So, <clears throat> if Jesus Christ is operating these spaceships, and one particular... That means Jesus Christ is what they call a so-called alien. And don't come on the channel and say, yo, uh, that's wrong, you bash me and all this. No. I hear, I question everything. See, people don't ask questions. They just sit there and listen to what somebody else got to say. You ain't got to listen to what I got to say. You don't have to listen to nothing I have to say. You go do your research. This is my final conclusion. I came up with everything. I read the books. I read through all of it, bro. That Jesus Christ is on a chariot spaceship. A flying saucer, bro. And when you think about it, they spoke of chariots back in the day. When Jesus Christ was getting resurrected at the cross. As they claim. But. This gotta be real, man. Jesus Christ been flying a spaceship around the whole world, man. Looking at us the whole time. That's why they say the Most High is always watching. And they know it. And they were to tell the public this people are being shocked. Everybody beliefs will be different. So called, you know. But can you imagine, like, Jesus Christ on a, on a flying saucer, bro, just pull up, get out, and come back to the world and be like, yo, I'm Jesus Christ. I've been flying this saucer the whole time. That'd be kind of weird when, and you know they say the Antichrist supposed to be coming, right? Maybe a, uh, the devil come into a spaceship and you know like the antichrist just come down here and say he the most high that's what they say the antichrist is supposed to present itself as the holy one but we haven't seen nothing come down here yet and when you think about jesus christ on this spaceship you know it's coming from the heavens above because every time they say they see a spaceship it's coming out the top in the top of the sky it's going back up to the top of the sky. So let me know. There must be a planet up there. Called heaven. And that's where these spaceships are going. And I'm not a nutcase. I'm not a weird, weirdo UFO researcher and all that. Because I don't get into that stuff. But nobody ever came out and said. This could be the most high. In this spaceship. And that's what I think about the chariots. You read about the Bible, you read the Bible, you go through there and say a chariot came in from heaven and picked them up and took them back to heaven. And when you think about it, spaceships come from the heavens above.
come down for a little while and investigate and go back up there. It all makes sense now. And I always remember how common sense. If you ain't got common sense, then you'll never understand anything. But what y'all think about this, man? Do y'all really think the Jesus Christ and one of the alien spaceships they claim? Or just another extraterrestrial being just being there? Maybe it's, you know, maybe there's more beings, but one of these spaceships, probably with a pretty one, probably belong to Jesus Christ, man. Probably a bright saucer, bro. Like, man, one of them gotta be. He gotta be in one of them, man. Cause they say the guys, they say the guys operate these spaceships, you know. So they saying the gods, that mean there's a lot of beings that people serve, you feel me? But let me know in the comment box, man. I'm out.